As the light of an October day faded last year, candles lit up a Prince William County neighborhood that gun violence had just devastated. I'm really shocked because, like, this is a pretty safe neighborhood and, like, things like this don't really happen here. Four people had been murdered inside of their home, and the man arrested will go before a judge later this month. At a recent public meeting, Prince William County's police chief said the 2022 crime report is, quote, not good news, according to reports from Potomac Local News, who covered the meeting. Tomorrow, Chief Pete Newsham will present that report to the county's Board of Supervisors and Chair Ann Wheeler. I believe that Prince William County is a very safe place, uh, but we want people to feel safe, and that's what's most important. Digging into the homicide numbers, there are a couple of takeaways. In 2022, Prince William's 20 homicides were more than the two previous years combined, and the most since 2016. Police report that 18 of those 20 cases last year are closed, and the suspect was known to the victim in each of those cases. The fact that the victims knew the people means these aren't random acts of violence. Prince William's Police Department is about 88% staffed, and the county board increased pay by 17% and is offering signing bonuses upwards of $10,000. It appears to be helping. Normally, Prince William graduates two classes of new cadets each year, but this year, they expect four classes. Reporting in Prince William County, Drew Wilder, News 4. News 4 requested an interview with Prince William County Police Chief Peter Newsham, but he declined until after tomorrow's presentation to the county board.